The year 2024 is turning out to be incredibly revealing, as numerous unexpected revelations are coming to light. Among the most startling developments is the news that Diddy, a longtime friend of Jay-Z, is poised to disclose all of their past exploits. For those who have been keeping tabs on the so-called surviving Diddy narratives, it's clear that this will likely cause turmoil within Jay-Z's circle. Reportedly, Beyoncé was taken aback upon discovering some of the evidence Diddy holds against Jay, evidence that Jay had not previously shared with her. Despite the unfolding drama, Beyoncé is determined not to be ensnared by Jay's controversies. Rumor has it she has already initiated divorce proceedings. This potential split could mark one of the most significant divorce scandals in recent history, especially considering Jay-Z and Beyoncé's status as one of Hollywood's most iconic couples, nearing two decades of marriage. Allegations suggest that Jay-Z might be the next target of Diddy's exposés, prompting Beyoncé to distance herself from the situation. This urgency is reflected in her accelerated promotion of her hair care line and music album, presumably to maximize her earnings before the divorce news hits the mainstream. Beyoncé's actions are not solely about evading the public relations nightmare surrounding Jay. For some time, observers have noted a perceptible change in her demeanor, indicating she might be weary of her role as Jay-Z's partner. With Diddy ready to unveil their shared history, Beyoncé seems to have found an opportune moment to end their relationship. The speculation around their divorce intensified following Jay-Z's public critique of the Grammys in defense of Beyoncé, an act that appeared to only embarrass her further, as evidenced by her reaction and their early departure from the event following Jay's speech. The Carter family left right after Jay-Z's speech. They didn't stay till the end. We all adore Beyoncé, but regrettably, it seems she has been discontent in her relationship with Jay-Z for quite an extended period. There's speculation that the pair have been living apart for a while, experiencing difficulties since before 2014. Recall the incident at the 2014 Met Gala, when footage emerged showing Beyoncé's sister Solange confronting Jay-Z in an elevator. Initially, it was speculated that Solange's actions were in response to Jay-Z's infidelity. The family issued a statement following the leak of the elevator footage, attempting to quell the speculation by stating they had worked through the incident, with Jay and Solange taking responsibility for their actions in what they described as a private matter made public. Despite their efforts to move past it, it appears Jay-Z's behavior did not change, as evidenced by Beyoncé's 2016 release of what many interpret as a breakup album directed at Jay-Z. Although attempts were made to mend their marriage, sources close to the couple suggest their relationship never fully recovered. Adding to the complexity, Beyoncé's former bodyguard, known as Uncle Ron, has shared insights on social media, suggesting the root of Beyoncé's dissatisfaction lies in being under Jay-Z's control for years. Uncle Ron has also hinted at questionable actions both Jay-Z and Beyoncé might have taken to advance their careers, shedding light on another layer of the challenges within their relationship. Uncle Ron has made some serious allegations, claiming that Jay-Z has been administering prescription medication to Beyoncé. This was supposedly done to ensure she could perform despite exhaustion and to help her sustain a specific public persona. However, an even more startling claim has surfaced, hinting at Jay-Z's past romantic preferences. According to Dame Dash, Aaliyah's former partner and Jay-Z's colleague at Rockefella Records, Jay-Z had previously shown a significant interest in pursuing Aaliyah while she was still underage. This revelation suggests that Beyoncé might not have been Jay-Z's initial choice for a partner. Important to note that Jay-Z's connections extend to some dark corners of the entertainment world. Allegations suggest that Jay-Z was well aware of R. Kelly's inappropriate behavior with Aaliyah, yet maintained a friendship with him. When Aaliyah chose to be with Dame Dash instead of Jay-Z, rumors suggest Jay-Z became infuriated over rejection. 
There are even claims that Jay-Z conspired with members of Aliyah's inner circle, including her manager and producer, to orchestrate her demise in a tragic plane crash. Strangely, soon after Aliyah's passing, Jay-Z and Beyonce went public with their relationship. Speculation persists regarding the timing of their meeting, with some sources suggesting it might have occurred when Beyonce was still underage, despite official reports indicating otherwise. The complexities of Jay-Z's personal life continue with allegations of a long-term relationship with Foxy Brown that reportedly began when she was underage. It's said that Jay-Z financially supported her during her high school years, maintaining their affair in secrecy. Despite Foxy Brown being questioned about their relationship, she has remained tight-lipped, fueling speculation of ongoing financial incentives to keep quiet. Now, in the face of mounting legal challenges, Diddy appears to be turning the tables on Jay-Z. Amidst lawsuits and resignations from executive roles, Diddy seems poised to expose his and Jay-Z's alleged collaboration in various illicit activities. However, Jay-Z's extensive influence in the industry, combined with his ability to keep certain aspects of his life out of the public eye, poses a challenge to these revelations gaining traction. One such hidden aspect is the alleged existence of Jay-Z's son, Ramir Sater. Despite Ramir's persistent pursuit of a paternity test to prove Jay-Z's parentage, Jay-Z has reportedly used his power to obstruct such efforts. Allegedly conceived in 1992 with Ramir's mother, Wanda, Jay-Z has never acknowledged Ramir as his child. Despite multiple legal attempts by Wanda and Ramir to hold Jay-Z accountable, they have been consistently thwarted by Jay-Z's connections and influence. Father, why you ain't just get this done over, done and over mm. with? You know, you know, my mom was a dancer. She used to go to a couple concerts for our friends, and basically they went to an apartment building. You know, they relaxed and chilled and, you know, had sex. As Jay-Z or any of his people tried to reach out to you to maybe, like, squash you from doing these? I mean, I wouldn't say they, they trying to stop it, but they, they, they definitely don't want it out there. I would say that. It's crazy to me. You know, I'm not asking for no money or nothing. I'm not asking for no handouts or nothing like that. I work every day, I take care of my family. Only thing I'm asking for, if it's if it's not the truth and there's nothing wrong with the Supreme Court, like, you know, just, just get it over with. Yeah, just get yeah. it over with. Yeah, yeah you just want the answer. If you found today's video insightful and you're keen on staying up to date with more fascinating celebrity tales, hidden industry secrets, and all the spicy drama from the world of showbiz, make sure you hit that subscribe button below.